All righty, folks, back with the second duel of the day. And we're going to be playing a match against Geo. Now, he did say only meta. And I believe that this deck is... Uh, is this deck meta? I think it is. I, I think it, it is meta. Um, oh, he's playing... He's playing Drew Draco. Okay, so yeah, we're... We're definitely going to be uh, taking apart your your times tables, sir. Definitely going to be taking apart your times tables. That's fine. Oh, okay. He surrendered. Golly, you're mad. Okay. What's going on? All right. So, yeah, we're... He's playing no... What's the name in this? What's, all right. So, yeah, he, he knows what he's playing. Uh, do we side drone? You know what I do? I think we do side in drone Lockbird just to stop him. We're going to take out these uh, virus cards and these trap tricks. And to put us down to 45 called by the grave once again he is playing a uh, true draco so there we go i believe i think we can get it if we could draw either a twin twister or a evenly match um and a droll no we didn't we just draw five fucking monsters fine oh okay all right yeah what well, that's fine that's fine you, you can have that sir you can have that um so then here because I, I don't think he plays anything of the sort um we just take out the drolls, we take out the evenly match, and then we just keep the twin sisters because literally, the call by the grave does nothing against him. I'm most likely 1,000% sure this man does not play hand traps. So if he does play hand traps, I mean, we just lose. We just lose because I know I'm gonna draw a twin twister and he's gonna have a hand trap, guaranteed, 100%. That's how this all works. That's how that's how my luck goes. And then, never mind. We just draw pretty much probably with the best hand you can actually attempt to ask for um yeah so let's see here let's see if he actually has it um since we do have the wyvern buster i don't think we need to uh i don't think we actually need to actually get what's the name so let's just grab a let's just grab a beast let's just grab a beast i um, actually probably should have grabbed the uh the what's the name the two star two. i'm pretty sure he doesn't play try like, see, this is what I'm talking about, man. Like, I'm playing against people who are just unconventional with their shits, bros. Fuck, I really want to keep this in a graveyard because I feel like it's gonna, it's gonna, it's gonna, something's gonna happen to me. Something's gonna happen. I already feel it. So, it's not really, it's not really. I, I feel it. I feel it coming. Oh my god, he doesn't have a hand trap. All right, so yeah, this this game is over, bros. This game is over. Yeah, 100%. This game is over. Um, but yeah, man, uh, he is playing true Draco. So I don't know if we, I don't know if I want to actually start off with just hitting him with, uh, hitting him with the eradicator. I don't, I think I should wait. I think, oh my God. Oh, okay. So since we do rescue cat, we can literally just put uh, that and then, um, we can put this back for free and then, um, my God, what do we put back here, folks? Cause we have monster reborn. I think the Paladin goes back, bros. Actually, I think Twin Twister goes back because yeah, we're not gonna need Twin Twister at this point. Um, yeah, we're not gonna even need Twin Twister at this point. We'll just banish that guy. Um, that's just to make him upset. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta use the card just to make him upset, folks. Um, all right, so yeah, um, like I said, we're gonna keep this because we can literally just go into another. We can go into Draxter. So uh, yeah, that's that's all fine and dandy with us. Let's get the red eyes. And since we do have what's name here, we're definitely going to be able to do all of that. Um, we're going to go Draco right there. And use these two to go into... Uh, Bam. This is going to get me out what's the name. Oh, I didn't use... Uh, I can just keep it. Yeah, that's for next. We're going to get a hot red... Then we're going to special summon this by banishing Clap Serpent. Um, all right, so there we go. Man. We we uh, we got a quick game against. Um, I'm, I guess it's True Draco, but it looks like it's just Stun. So maybe that's what it is. Uh, Wyvern Buster and that guy one two. Definitely want to do Wyvern Buster first because this hands out a card. So we li we're literally going to just draw basically to draw two to back two. There's an Eradicator. We can actually just keep both of those. Um, so yeah, we definitely put you. <laughs> we have to put you. One out of two, we got to put those two back. And then um, I think we just have to put Clash Urban back because it doesn't really get us to where we need to get to. Um, I think he's going to quit actually once he sees this rescue cat. So um, I think he's going to quit now. Oh, he doesn't quit. All right. So he's playing through. So it means he does have Kaijus in his hand. 
he has a kaiju or he has access to a kaiju so that's that's that we'll put that over there um we'll go monster reborn and i think here see i think here see look this is this is this is my thought process right now right now if i just eradicate or just start the game off i get to see his hand why did i keep trap tricks in that's stupid i shouldn't i mean it, I, I i couldn't really take anything else out so doesn't really matter um we'll just press him on this and then we'll just go don dragster with this well we can go crystal wing but that's kind of stupid and we'll just go draw direction right there and then yeah we'll just set this and uh yeah man so yeah let's see let's see what we can actually do because we actually probably should have we should probably should have kept the twin twister here because like i said we can negate all his spells and even if he does something spark the border it doesn't really matter um so we really just it's about his in phase so i think i think we can literally just call traps here Oh fuck, I think I should have did it. I was about to say, yeah, what thing doesn't exist, so I think we're fine. Yeah, I think we're fine. Yeah, he, he's gonna be upset. He's gonna be upset. Yeah, okay, there we go. Good job, Geo. Appreciate you not quitting. Let's go see what this man had. Let's go see what this man had. Uh, we'll be right back with a pause. As a matter of fact, just so I don't mess up and lose this damn recording, I'll be right back. All right, so, oh, it was true Draco. My God, is he was he drawn into what's the name? He, he drew in the diagram. He actually, he actually could have, oh shit, no. Um, he actually could have played around it because, oh no, no, actually he couldn't have. No, because I, yeah, like I said, he, he has no way, he had no tribute. So he was playing true Draco and he was playing, did he play any hand, oh, he put in drolls. I don't know why. I guess that's his only hand trap side. I, like I, said, I, I didn't. I didn't expect him to actually play hand traps. I didn't think he was going to side in the hand traps either. I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong about that. But uh, yeah, we definitely should put a second trap to side in game three, like to side in multiples of game three. That's a common trap that literally shuts down our opponent. So we already have Eradicator. We already have Deck Devi. This full force actually fucks this deck up as well because they're all under. Yeah, they're all under 15. So I think Full Force might actually have to come in the side so we can literally take out uh we could take out the deck devils if we're playing something like True Draco or high attack deck, or low defense deck. You see what I'm saying? So we could technically do that, and that literally would have just shut all this shit off. And I, like I said, I could have just started with Eradicator to call traps. And I think that might have been the best play because uh, we know he was playing true Draco, so if he would have set a trap, and if he had a monster to actually summon, then we would have lost the monster for free. But like I said, I think the best play for that one was just Eradicator during the draw phase because I did have a trap tricks. So just in case he was playing, if he still was playing, like I don't know, I mean, he kind of could have been playing like uh, just a complete stun deck, so it could have been barrier statues. But I had protection from spells, so I think 100% that should have been the case. Um, if he would have tribute summon as high as he would have had to draw the blue and he would have just crashed with this But like I said, I would have known his hand at that point So when I did not if you just would have did diagram I would have negated it and then I still would have of uh, I still would have um I still have hot red dragon arch for the second diagram So I don't think yeah, like I said, I think we still would have won regardless So yeah, see at that point see look that's that's my mind frame folks But you know, like I said yeah, when, yeah, at locals I got punished for doing that for playing the right way i mean I, I feel like that's the correct play see as like i said i had spell negation so i think i should have just shotgunned eradicator to call trap just to see what his hand was if he doesn't have any traps okay we know that he has all spells that means he can't get over this what's the name he can't get over this nature beast and we just win the duel if he does have traps like as in this you know we're able to get rid of all of his traps and then like i said he can't use spells to draw no more because like i said we had nature beast and we had don dragster and hot red arch fiend but then, see me being me waiting. If he had any what's the name, I could have lost. I could have lost a free material beast for no reason. And then that would have been what? Then I would have lost. And then I would have been oh well. Why didn't you just shotgun eradicate? I think at that point I should have shotgun eradicate. All right, so let's see if we can get another little small game real quick and we break. All right, folks, back again. And we won the rock paper scissors again. And at that point, you know what? Kind of, I think we should probably main what's the name. I think we should probably main. Uh, I think we should actually main full force over what's the name i think that might be the better 
the better option i think so what do you guys think do you guys think that i think it might be the better option bros 100 percent. i think that might be the better option to make four for us because deck devi while it does oh, i don't know because i gotta check the solomon the great's defense out like if their defense is like shitty then you know we can just work with that um so here oh we can't add draco back fudge so right, if he stops this we're actually just in a bunch of shit um no not actually not now that if he does you know we can probably do something after this um uh, but yeah I, I don't know because full force while it doesn't hit hand traps at that point in time if we do resolve a full force we wouldn't even need the hand trap i mean we wouldn't really care about the hand traps because our hand i mean we've already successfully pulled off the combo so what do you guys think man i don't know because i like deck debbie is just a super good um wow we didn't draw anything we'll put you you and you back right yeah because we haven't used anything yet so um magus we'll banish magus but uh you guys let me know what what, what do you guys think do you think full force or what's name is better which one is better right now i'm not sure i think I, I think full force might be a little better i don't know if it hits more matchups than it does than deck devy because i know deck devy hits a shit ton of matchups but i'm just i'm just trying to see what's what's happening here folks we'll, we'll, we'll figure it out we'll figure it out um you guys let me know down uh, in the comments down below all right so here we go now we just really want to just draw into a uh like i said to a trap tricks or something and then we just hopefully we can get free advantage hopefully our point our, ah, our, our opponent actually plays a card first then we can actually just you know go off from there and then use you know the appropriate either eradicator um well eradicator might just append if we get a notorious beast i think we just go deck devi at that point because what what deck is really playing that many fucking traps that you know sounds like true draco but like I said, he has 15 extra decks so um we'll see we'll see you guys you know how we all we make our decisions here Ooh, there's an eradicator that's cool um so we can't summon you it's pointless to have you and then like i said there's just multiple what's the name so we just put those three back um all right so here i think we actually no no we not, i was about to say i think we're gonna grab a, a deck devy but we can't we literally just can't get a deck devy here um so yeah we'll just use these two man god damn it we didn't draw on the shit man trap tricks is so amazing though so we just set these two like we do have six interruptions so technically we should be able to kill our opponent but we don't have any monster interruption so that is actually we do have a monster negation i don't know why i said that all right so let's see what our opponent is playing here so if he's playing if he starts off with it, it depends on the spell he starts off with if he starts off with a random spell then um i think we could just use that to our advantage here um if he starts off with like the solomon the great spell i think we wait if he starts off with um terraforming to like a hidden city then you guys already know we, we're going to negate that hidden city but then we're going to call traps we're going to call traps after that so let's see what our opponent actually has in store for us like i said i'll allow him to do that and then i'll just think oh, okay magician's pro well, this this is just easy so yeah we're just gonna do this yeah this is just real easy now um we're not going to change because if we, we could get technically hit by a call by the grave yes yeah, so we're just going to call spells here this, that, that, the thing that might just be the match Golly, you're mad. Okay. All right. <laughs> That's Guard Dragon for you guys, man. Virus Guard Dragon. All right, folks. So once again, that was uh, Guard Dragon. So hopefully you guys did enjoy that video. Uh, Wednesday, hopefully, I do I do have the cards. I have four cards slated for this video. I'm just trying to figure out the fifth card. Hopefully, I'm able to figure out the fifth card because I really want to tell you guys about the text. I feel they're going to be best. But basically for the next video i'm trying to put out a like a tech video hopefully um i'm able to figure out a fifth card if not i think i'll just do the four because i've literally been thinking for the past week for a fifth card and i just can't seem to really think of one but we're probably like i said I'll, I'll figure one out anyways thank you guys for watching i hope you guys did enjoy the video like comment and subscribe if you haven't already and if you guys want to help the channel out links are in the description down below for you guys to do that also if you guys would like to help the channel out Links is also, oh wait, I already said that, right? Yeah. Also, you guys can click an ad to help support the channel. Um, and if you guys wanna uh, help support the channel by clicking the ad and donating, 
Um, links are in the description down for that. I know it's, it's third time I didn't say that already. Um, so yeah. Anyways, we're gonna be done with this video. See you guys back Wednesday with another upload. Hopefully, it's my tech video. And then Friday, we're gonna go back in with zombies. But we're gonna go. We're gonna change it up. We're gonna be switching a lot of cards out of the deck that I've been playing last Monday, and uh, orchid zombies. We're gonna, and we, and we're gonna just you know try to fit, try to make it as consistent as possible because we're there. I feel like we're there.